eight. Hi guys, it's Thursday here on the cinema. Uh, oh. Thursdays here in the cinema, in case you didn't already know, and I give you advice. I go on my Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and I'm like, what do you needle dicks need advice on? And some of you write in, I respond, and we create magic. Ah! Punk Jamie, hey Emma, hey. So there's a girl in form who's so annoying and is overly outrageous for no reason. How do I politely tell her to shut the fuck up? What's form? Are you British by any chance? Because Brits always have the coolest words for things. Just be really polite about it, almost apologetic about the fact that you're asking her to be quiet. Be like, oh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. Do you mind shutting the fuck up? Excuse me. Hello, I'm so sorry to bother you. Do you mind shutting the fuck up? Hello, I'm so sorry to bother you. Do you mind shutting the fuck up? Good luck. Sarah N. Aesthetic. Hi, Emma. Hi. You're so awesome. Hi, thanks. I invited my friend to be my bridesmaid when I first got engaged and she hasn't talked to me for like a year, but she assumes she's still a bridesmaid. How do I tell her she's not a bridesmaid anymore? No disrespect to the girl or anything and, and I'm not trying to be mean, but if she hasn't talked to you in like a year and she's assuming she's still one of your bridesmaids, she's kind of a fucking idiot. You could try being honest with her about it, but damn if that's not going to be an awkward conversation. <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna get married once, maybe three times tops in my lifetime, and I need this day to be really special. A.G. Hawkins, Ag Hawkins, A.G. Hawkins 8, Ag Hawkins 8. Hi, Emma. Hi. How can we break the taboo of miscarriage? Oh shit, this is a serious one. It's rarely discussed. I had two and I've never felt so alone. How can we help those who suffer? Is this another thing that women have decided to pit other women against each other about? I know that's probably not grammatically correct, but you know what I mean. It's your life, your body, your experience. You should be able to talk freely about something like this and to hell with what people think. If there are no support groups for you, no adequate support groups for you while you're going through this, then I would suggest maybe starting your own because chances are if you feel like this, there are other women who feel like this and they would greatly benefit from having your point of view. Bubble trip, hi Em, hi! There's this guy I like. Actually, there's also this super awesome girl always by his side. She is smart, cultivated, cultivated? Funny, cool, pretty, and at ease in any situations. How do I eradicate her? Considering that she is a good friend of mine. Doesn't sound like it. <laughs> This guy's got a girlfriend, you know, so why don't you just let that be? There are plenty of other guys out there. You'll find someone eventually. That rhymed. And just because karma's a bitch doesn't mean you have to be one too. Daisy Chains Rock. Hi, Emma. Hi, Daisy. Can you come to my birthday party? No, I'm sorry. But thanks for asking. Constable, constable, tangerine. How do I stop myself from strangling my annoying boss at work? She hovers and has a very annoying voice. When you get home, grab a pillow and just do this. <laughs> I feel better just doing that. Okay guys, that was a super fun S Nama Thursday here on S Nama. Until next time, say gay.